In this video, I'm going to go over the top features of the brand new OnePlus 11. And hopefully this video will help you figure out if this phone is worth it for you. So this is the green version. It doesn't look that green in this camera. Depending on the lighting, it looks a little bit lighter. It looks a little bit gray, but it's definitely green. And I like it like that. It's, it has a good grip too. I don't have the case on it. My case is right here. I just took off the case so you can see how clear it is and how awesome it looks. But before I go into all of the top features, I gotta give you guys my disclaimer that this video is not sponsored by OnePlus or anyone. So if I say anything good, it's just from my experience and no one is telling me to say anything. And let's start off with the main feature that is very visible on the back and that is the three main cameras. Okay, so right now you're looking at some video that I recorded with the OnePlus 11 and I had the video stabilizer on so you can see that I am walking but the video is still pretty smooth. Now you can see a side by side comparison between stabilization on and off. And now let's go ahead and take a look at some photos that I took this is just from around my area. You can see the camera really shines when you have an environment that has a lot of color in it. The photos look amazing. The weather hasn't been that great lately, so I haven't been able to take too many pictures, but I'm definitely going to do a follow up video and do more. Now let's talk about some of the specs. The version that I am using right now has 16 gigabytes of RAM, has 256 gigabytes of storage, it has Dolby Atmos, so the sound quality is amazing. There is no micro SD card slot, but instead, when you take out the SIM card tray, you can have two SIM cards inside. So that comes in handy if you want to have a work number and a personal number. Another feature I want to mention is something small, but it sets this phone apart from the others out there, and that is the alert slider. On the right hand side of the phone, you can see this little slider right here and it has a little bit of a textured grip so that even if it's in your pocket, you can feel it. If you slide it one time, that will put the phone in vibrate mode. If you slide it again, that will turn off all the sounds and vibrations. So that is great if you want to mute your phone very quickly without turning it off. So let's say you're at a movie theater or you're at a meeting. Right now I am recording with the OnePlus 11. This is the front facing camera and you can see the depth of field. You can see the background is blurred. I really like the way the quality looks, especially as a YouTuber. I'm always making videos. This is going to be my main camera for making videos from now on. One of my favorite features of this phone is rapid charging and it can charge your phone in about 20 minutes. It sounds like one of those gimmicky features that you don't really believe, but I tried it and this phone charges very fast. As you can see right here, my phone was at 10% and within 15 minutes, it got up to about 80%. So when you use the original charger, just for a few minutes, your phone is gonna be good for most of the day. And that is easily one of the top five features that you need in a smartphone. Even though we got all these portable batteries, nobody really wants to carry them or carry chargers. And the cool thing is as soon as you plug up the phone with the charger, you can see the battery go up within a few seconds. As I mentioned before, this phone is pretty powerful with 16 gigabytes of RAM, and it's powered by a Snapdragon 8 Gen 2. So it can definitely play so it can definitely play any mobile game on the Google Play Store with ease. So I heard that this phone had really good cooling and of course I had to put it to the test. So far in the past few days of gaming, the phone did not overheat, the frame rate has not dropped, the gameplay stayed smooth, and overall it was an awesome experience for gaming. Maybe one of the best phones out there for gaming, for video editing, content creators. I have a second part to this video and that is gonna mostly focus on the camera especially during nighttime. That is going to be a fun video to do. But until then, be sure to hit the subscribe button. And if you have any questions, you can leave in the comments below or you can reach out to me on Instagram.